Hi, this is Abby Rogers with Dry Steam. In this video, I'm going to outline the routine maintenance that Dry Steam recommends for the vapor mist and CRUV humidifiers. Be sure to review all guidelines, warnings, and cautions in the IOM before you begin your work on site. Here is a list of tools and supplies you will need. Basic hand tools, open end and box wrenches, a set of nut drivers or a drill with driver bits, clamp meter, and of course, the vapor mist or CRUV IOM for detailed information on how to perform the maintenance tasks. Before you head out to the site, here are some things you should verify. The unit can be shut down long enough for scheduled maintenance to be completed, and that the maintenance location for the unit is clear with clearances as shown in the IOM. Typically, routine maintenance that Dry Steam recommends for the vapor mist and CRUV humidifiers will take about three to four hours. Unit size, water type, and other factors may affect the amount of time required. At least annually and whenever maintenance is performed, inspect the tank and gaskets for leaks, measure current draw of heaters and verify amp values per stage by comparing to the wiring diagram located inside the sub-panel cover. This identifies any burned out heaters. Only qualified electrical personnel should perform this task. All safety devices in the control circuit should be cycled on and off to verify they are functioning. These include high limit device, airflow proving switch, low water level probe, or float switch. Seasonally, remove the two fasteners on each side of the cover enclosure. Remove the enclosure, and if the tank is hot, cool it down. Shut off the water supply. Allow the tank to drain completely. Shut off the electrical supply. Disconnect the fill line at the supply side of the fill valve. Disconnect the electrical plugs between the tank components in the back of the electrical panel. Remove the evaporating chamber. Loosen the four cover bolts and remove the cover assembly from the tank. The best way to determine how often your humidifier needs maintenance is to remove the tank cover and inspect it for mineral deposits after three months of duty. Hours of operation and duty cycle will determine your maintenance schedule, as will water quality. Clean the tank interior using a putty knife or similar flat instrument. Clean and inspect probe rod assembly. Install the probe and probe plug assembly. Verify ground wire is solidly connected to the tank. Secure the cover. Reinstall evaporating chamber. Verify electrical connections. Move the drain valve lever back to the auto position. Turn on the water supply and turn on electrical power. For off-season maintenance, perform complete inspection and cleaning of the following. Heaters, probe rods, skimmer port and water seal, and humidifier tank. After cleaning, the humidifier should remain powered off and empty until humidification is required. Now you are ready to perform routine maintenance of the vapor mist and CRUV humidifiers. Taking time to plan and perform maintenance on a regular schedule will keep the equipment up and running at peak performance for many years.